Ah, you're wrong. Yes. Got, well, I don't even know where to start. We're working on a Defender now. Got the new overlay done, but we're going to show you Robotron. This one came out remarkable. Brand new overlay from Arcade Shops. We have the original buttons that glow. There are little lights in there that glow them. Uh, T red T molding. And we have this set up on CoinUp because the customer is actually going to put it into his restaurant. And I think it'll do pretty good. We have new casters on it. Look at the side art. How nice, ugh, how nice that came out. <laughs> Come over here. Come over here. Go over here. Now, there we go. This is Walter filming. Make sure this is in focus. Yeah, I mean, you don't want to. This is that nice. Very nice. Steven repainted all the gray. We've added the, the red and the blue touch ups. Came out remarkable. Back here. Come back here. I'll show you what we did back here. New computer grade power supply, and it's wired in with a plug so it can be changed down the road easily by the new owner. Whatever he wants to do, he can change that out. Monitors recap with new parts, uh, new caps. Uh, battery has the lithium in it now. We reflowed solder on all the edges too, so that's working really good. I'm really happy at how nice that came out. Uh, let's see. Oh, solder it over here. Over here. Now, I also want to point out we have the original Robotron joysticks. Now, Robotron was one of the few games that used these really tall sticks. Uh, sometimes if the sticks break, people put shorty ones in, but see how nice and tall they are? You can get your hand over there and really, really move that puppy. You really have to. I mean, you have to be able to wiggle this baby around and kill, okay? The game is just plain terrific, and I said once again, you just can't get over using these leaf switch. I want to show you this abomination. Uh, actually, we have two more Robotron, they're all gone. This is how they look when we start. Look what some blockhead did. They put micro switch joysticks in. Yes, we are changing these back to um, leaf switch. We have a coin door going on it. Uh, look, somebody, they took out the lighted buttons, but uh, it's just unbelievable what people do to these things. So this is what they look like before we start on them. So we're working on this one now. Nobody is gonna get that phone, oh, are they? We got a hot solder. Oh my gosh, she's got a hot one. Frank, look at Frank. Frank is busy. We're working on this Galaga. It's 10 o'clock at night. We are knocking these babies out fast. And I want you to see one last thing though before we close. Look at this. Ugh, this Tempest. These are the best parts of two Tempests. So you're gonna see how nice this is gonna be coming out because we are going to renovate this so it looks like brand new. So we actually got all the parts of the two Tempests. Have the best cabinet. We're going to rework this cabinet. It's going to look terrific when we're done. Got an Alley Cats we're finishing up for another customer over there. And I think you saw earlier, we're still working on this very rare pistol poker. Only 200 in the world. And we have one really nice one, but we haven't painted it or done anything to it yet. We're working on the playfield. That's it. We're done. We're in the yellow pages under amusement. Ah, living is good, isn't it, folks? That's all for now. Good night.